Well, the weather might be miserable down in Melbourne, but Sydney siders have been enjoying a rare Saturday of sunshine. It was a busy afternoon down at Bondi as beachgoers made up for lost time catching waves and soaking up rays. Others took in the markers of spring, lazing near the flowers in Centennial Park. It's rained on almost 30 weekends in Sydney this year. This one is very unlikely to add to that tally. The chance of rain today is forecast at zero percent. Well, let's take a closer look at the weather now. It's reached the mid-20s right across the city today. Overnight lows were mostly above average for the coast and central tablelands, down to just six in Griffith and Orange. Winds in the west were moderate west to southwesterly, fresh about the southern ranges. Maximum temperatures were slightly above average along the coast, reaching 30 in parts of the north. In the capital cities today, it was warm and sunny in Brisbane, much cooler for Canberra, Melbourne and Hobart. Perth was partly cloudy in 18. On the satellite, a large cloud band off the southeast of the state is linked with a deep low to the southeast of Tasmania, which could bring rain later in the week. A weak high developed over western New South Wales. Tomorrow, a trough is expected to enter the far west. Around the country tomorrow, another warm and sunny day for Brisbane, a late shower for Melbourne and 21 showers and a possible storm for Adelaide. Mostly clear and sunny right across the northeast tomorrow, winds up to 20 knots on the water. A little cooler but mostly sunny for the southeast, partly cloudy further down the coast. Seas will reach 2.5 metres. Inland, showers expected in the central tablelands, possible thunderstorms in the west, partly cloudy elsewhere. Winds on Sydney waters will reach up to 25 knots. In Sydney tomorrow, a little cooler than today, but mostly clear right across the basin. The sun will rise at 5.56. And looking ahead, rain will return on Monday and Tuesday before we see another sunny break. Well, that's all from ABC News. Enjoy the rest of your evening.